Welcome back to Skibbity Tech. Today, I'm going to show you the latest and the safe method to install IPA files on your iPhone and iPad using eSign. No jailbreak required, no computer needed. So let's get started. So first you need to open this website and set up your own DNS. Just open the page and then write the profile and then device name in it. After that simply hit download, then hit allow to download the profile. Now open your iPhone settings, then open your downloaded profile, then simply hit install to install the profile. Now open this website and then hit on eSign certificate, then hit download to download the eSign certificate's zip file. Next hit on eSign Sunshine one, then hit open, then hit install to install eSign app in your iOS device. Once eSign app is installed, now open iPhone settings, then open general, then open VPN and device management. Then simply open and trust the Sunshine Group app so that the eSign app can work in your iOS device. Now open the eSign app, then hit three dots on top, and then choose import option. Now select the eSign certificate zip file we have downloaded before. Now hit on eSign certificate zip file and then hit unzip to unzip the eSign certificate file. Then open the eSign certificate folder and then hit on Sunshine 1 eSign certificate and then hit import certificate management. Once it shows imported successfully, now you'll need the IPA file you want to install. Once you've found the IPA you want, Download it directly to your device, then open the eSign app, and then hit on top three dots. Then hit import, and then select your IPA file, and then hit import. Once your IPA file imported successfully, now hit on the apps, and then hit on your app, and then hit on signature, and then hit signature again. Once it's signed 100%, then simply hit install to install your IPA file into your iOS device. And that's it, you've successfully installed an IPA file on your iPhone or iPad using eSign, all without a jailbreak or computer. If you found this tutorial helpful, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe for more iOS tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.